Insomniac Games has put an end to the rumors suggesting that Marvel's Spider-Man 2 will have co-op gameplay, confirming that it will be an epic single-player adventure. Speculation about co-op arose after comments made by the voice actor for Miles Morales last year. However, Insomniac responded to a fan's query on Twitter, stating that co-op is not part of the game's plans. While details about Spider-Man 2 remain scarce, with a release targeted for fall 2023, fans are hoping for more information during Sony's upcoming PlayStation Showcase. Blizzard is reportedly exploring the use of AI-generated art, according to an email from Alan Atham, Blizzard's chief design officer. The tool, called Blizzard Diffusion, is already generating concept art for environments and character designs, and another tool is being used for fitting headpieces in World of Warcraft. The email also mentioned the potential for AI-powered in-game NPCs, procedurally assisted level design, voice cloning, game coding, and even AI-driven anti-toxicity technology. However, the feasibility and effectiveness of implementing AI for player interactions remains a question. Blizzard had previously abandoned a machine learning tool for environmental textures due to resource concerns. Lawsuit was filed against Nintendo by a young player, claiming that the loot boxes in the mobile game Mario Kart Tour promote addictive gambling-like behavior. The loot boxes, known as Spotlight Pipes, previously allowed players to spend real money for undisclosed odds to obtain upgrades. The plaintiff spent over $170 on microtransactions and alleges that Nintendo intentionally directed players towards these loot boxes for game progression. Nintendo replaced the Spotlight Pipes with an in-game shop last year. Similar legal scrutiny has been faced by other companies, such as Epic Games, resulting in fines and a shift towards alternative monetization models like Battle Passes. Japanese developer Yux, known for its WWE games, is making its return to the wrestling genre with the upcoming release of IEW, Fight Forever, on June 29th. Yux had a long-standing association with WWE games until 2K decided to exclusively hand over the series to visual concepts in 2018. Now, Yux is partnering with publisher THQ Nordic to develop AEW. Fight Forever, that promises a retro design approach with handcrafted animations, diverse match types, a career mode, online multiplayer, and extensive customization options. The game will be available on Xbox, PlayStation, Switch, and PC. If you enjoyed this video, please consider liking and subscribing. Thank you for watching, until next time.